The unofficial Apple downloading service, App Valley, which allows us to get Airshow and Evercord, has undergone a couple of minor changes in the last couple of weeks, which has confused a couple of users, so let's take a look. This tutorial is based off of the assumption that you've never downloaded App Valley before, so follow these steps. Make sure that your Safari browser is completely closed down so that when you open it, you're getting a fresh web page. And when it does come up, you want to go to the following web address, which is appvalley.vip. And you should be presented with the following screen. Now here you can see an install app valley button. This won't actually install an application. What it will do now instead is install a profile onto your iOS device. So when this pop-up appears, tap allow. That should automatically take you to your settings and offer you an install profile pop-up. So tap the install button. You will then need to put in your passcode. And once you've done that, it should ask you whether you want to install the profile, which you do. And once you've gone through all these steps, when you go back to your home screen, you should automatically see a new application, which is App Valley. So I believe the logic behind this is that with App Valley using certificates, one of the times that they have to use this certificate is when you install the application. So it's just reducing the number of certificates it used to prevent it from being revoked more often. And from here, it's the usual steps. Go into the App Valley program, which now works in landscape mode, which I'm very thankful about. And then you can find your screen recorders in the browse section of the apps. So I'm going to find, uh, let's see, I'm going to find Airshow right there. Tap the get button. That should bring up an install profile, which it will do. And uh, another good piece of news is that the installs now are very quick from App Valley. They did slow down for a little while. But there we are, Airshow installing within a space of about 10 seconds there. Now, applications that do still use certificates. So if I try and launch it, I'll get the untrusted enterprise developer error. To fix that, you would go to, once we've sorted out the settings screen here, you go to general. Scroll down to Profile and Device Management. Find a certificate that it's now connected to, which I'm going to guess is that one. I'm right first time. Trust it as usual. And then until the certificate is revoked, Airshow and any other screen recorder from App Valley should work as normal. So as I say, that's a relatively simple change, but some of you were getting a little concerned about it. Now, in wider news, services such as App Valley and Tutu have been under an attack for their certificates constantly being revoked. However, there may now be a solution which means that certificates never get revoked. If I've done a video, you'll find it right here, right now. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you found it useful. If you want more iOS screen recording content just like this, then subscribe to the Video Gadgets Journal. Enjoy the rest of your tech day. Bye for now.